Kobe Street Department. Here's some parts Justin just sprayed some crushed diamonds on. We're going to do the artwork next. And we'll give you more pictures as we go. Turned out beautiful. House of Colors. All the way, baby. Hi there. I'm Gilby from Gilby Street Department. I'm going to show you the next step on painting these parts that we had sprayed silver. House of Colors. Crushed diamonds. The next step is going to be a little bit of black over the top of this. So it'll be silver the black graphics. Everything's masked off nice and tight, no bleed throughs. Push down the tape about 10-15 times over just to double check everything. And we'll show you the next step. Alright, here's the parts. We got them unmasked. And this is how it looks. The crushed diamonds go through the black a little bit. The lines are masked off nice and tight. Now we're off to give them three coats of clear. Okay, these are the parts. They just come out of the spray booth. Three coats of clear. And the next step will be airbrushing and pinstriping. Crushed diamonds, house of color paint. Beautiful. The next step to the custom paint job, we've got these parts, graphics painted, cleared, sanded, and now we're going to do the drop shot with an airbrush. So airbrushing is easy for certain things like this. If you, uh, oh, that's stupid. All right, the next step on the custom paint job is airbrushing. We're going to put a drop shadow on all the flames, and it's uh, very simple to do. Grab an airbrush, put a little black in it, and that's how it's done. Just like that. Very simple. Get yourself an airbrush, a little practice, and you can really add to the paint job. Now we'll take and put a red pinstripe around this and clear it, and the parts will be done. Stay tuned. Okay. I'm getting ready to put the pinstripe outline around the graphics. We airbrush and drop shadow around them. Now I got a Mac. Sword striper brush, pulse of color, striping paint, wet the brush, put it on and give her all you got. You get the corners, spin the brush. So you can make it around the corners. Make the points nice and sharp. Let the brush down again a little bit. Let her roll. Put her down and give her. point. Take your time. Do a good job. Wet the brush. Now go around this corner. Spin the brush. Nice 
sharp point. Get the brush a little bit thinner, keep the paint nice and loose so it flows nice. Lay the brush down, and get her going. Just pull those lines steady and continuously, and you got it. A nice point, make those points nice and sharp. like that. Now I'll just finish these and the job will be done.